23 Interesting Facts About Antarctica A Number 1. The dry valleys in Antarctica are the driest places on Earth. With such low humidity and moisture on this portion of the continent, snow and ice cannot even accumulate, which leaves the valleys as just a dusty expanse of dirt. Number 2. Antarctica is, on average, the windiest place on Earth. Scientists exploring the southerly landmass have reported wind speeds that have reached up to 200 miles per hour. Number 3. The Antarctic Ice Sheet is the single biggest mass of ice in the world and can sometimes be up to 4 miles thick. The continent as a whole contains about 90% of the planet's freshwater ice and around 70% of the total freshwater on Earth. Number 4. Scientists claim that if the West Antarctic Ice Sheet were to melt, it would raise global sea levels by about 16 feet. Number 5. The Ross Ice Shelf, a floating tongue of ice that extends off the continent's main landmass, encompasses more than 510,000 square kilometers and is the largest ice shelf that has ever been discovered. Sunset in the La Mer Channel, Antarctica 1-5 Sunset in the La Mer Channel, Antarctica. Number 6. While Antarctica is covered in ice, it actually holds one of the world's biggest mountain ranges, the Gamberts Mountains, which stretch out more than 1,200 kilometers. The highest peaks are estimated to be around 2,800 meters or about one-third the size of Earth's tallest mountain, Mount Everest. Number 7. Another interesting geographic feature hidden under the ice sheet is Lake Vostok, a freshwater lake buried under 4 kilometers of frozen water. This lake is about the size of Lake Ontario and is one of more than 200 different bodies of water that has been discovered beneath the ice. Number 8. While the Grand Canyon is largely considered to be the planet's biggest natural rift, scientists discovered another trench on Antarctica that could rival one of America's mightiest natural features. The unnamed canyon was found during a 2010 expedition and extends 100 kilometers, is more than 9 kilometers wide and reaches depths of more than 1,6 kilometers. Scientists speculate that it could be even larger, but further exploration is required to learn the true boundaries of this massive rift. Number 9. Antarctica is home to Mount Erebus, the southernmost active volcano in the world, as well as the only known lava lakes, which have held liquid magma ferians despite the continent's frigid conditions. Number 10. There are 30 different countries that operate 80 research stations situated around the continent. The human inhabitants who occupy these facilities number around 4,000 during the summer months and only 1,000 during the long, harsh winters. Number 11. In January of 1979, Emil Marco Palma became the first human ever to be born on Antarctica. Since his historic passage through the birth canal, only 10 other people have been born on the continent. Number 12. Because of the Earth's tilt, the sun does not rise in Antarctica from the vernal equinox to the autumnal equinox, which means the continent remains dark throughout the entire winter season. Number 13. Conversely, during the summer months the sun does not set in Antarctica, which means it actually receives more sunlight than the equator during that time frame. Number 14. In March of 2000, an ice chunk broke off the Ross Ice Shelf that was 270 kilometers long and 40 kilometers wide or roughly the size of the state of Connecticut. Number 15. Deep Lake in Antarctica is so salty that it cannot freeze even in temperatures as low as negative 15 degrees Celsius. On number 16. Seriously thick ice. One of the most fascinating things about Antarctica is that it is, in fact, a land mass. Explorers traveling to the North Pole were only ever standing on ice and hope, South Pole explorers have something more substantial underneath. However, in parts of Antarctica, the land itself is far underneath indeed, some of the ice is more than a mile thick. Abundant Resources Most of the planet's fresh water sits in Antarctica's ice. This ice-covered continent actually contains the vast majority of Earth's fresh water, about 70%. This is one of the many reasons the ice cap is such a precious resource, as that ice melts, it mixes into the salt water surrounding it. Desalination, or the process of removing fresh water from salt water, is notoriously tricky to do on a large scale, which means it's vital to keep that fresh water separate and safe. Number 17. Hidden Lake. Antarctica has a secret lake, many secret lakes, in fact. 
Scientists have drilled far beneath the thick glacial ice atop Antarctica to find liquid lakes below. The most exciting part, these lakes are absolutely teeming with microscopic life. Scientists can use water samples to learn about how these minuscule creatures survive in such a harsh environment. This could even give researchers an idea for how life might survive on other planets, such as below the ice found on Mars. The Massive Mountains A huge mountain chain divides the Antarctic continent into eastern and western regions. The series of mountains is one of the longest in the world, and extends over 2,000 miles. A good portion of these mountains are buried beneath Antarctica's ice and snow, but many of the peaks are steep enough to be snow-free. Number 18. Lots of research. Though there are no truly permanent residents in Antarctica, there are people there all year round. The continent's isolation and harsh climate, though difficult to live in, make it perfect for all manner of study. Researchers stay in Antarctic bases and study the continent's life, geography and temperature. It's also a prime location for astronomers, the clear conditions of near permanent darkness in winter make for ideal stargazing. Number 19. Midnight, or absent, sun. When you travel to Antarctica, you'll get to see one of the most fascinating sights in the world, the midnight sun. South of the Antarctic Circle, there is a period of months when the sun never sets. Summers near the South Pole are perpetually bright, which means you can sit outside and read at midnight, if you like. Researchers who stay all year round also experience the opposite, permanent Antarctic darkness. However, tourists can only see this astronomical event in the Arctic Circle, as Antarctica's tourist season ends after summer. Number 20. Wind. Antarctica's geography and climate means it gets a special kind of wind called katabatics. These are winds that are formed when air moves down a slope. In Antarctica, the mountain range paired against large, flat expanses makes for a dramatic wind combination. Some of the highest wind speeds in history have been recorded on the southern continent. In fact, the world record for wind speed is tied between Antarctica's Dumont Triple Station and Mount Washington, New Hampshire, both of which have experienced winds of 320 km per hour.